What's up guys, it's Bert back here, and we're jumping back into some mods to the Spire. So last time, we played the Potion Brewer. Boom, there's the picture. Um, and just uh, from some misplay and not paying attention, we did not get very far in the two runs. However, we get to do a little bit of fun and do the Hunter again. Um, people have liked it, so the like the character art, even though there's some misplay. We're gonna jump into it. I'm excited because um, I think the mechanics work a little different with them. So we were gonna choose randomly. Boom, got that sprite. Talk to them. All right. Let me remember what star red. Uh, in the comment, there was a chance to add a random reward to the rewards group. Pretty good. Random rare card? Choose a rare card. I think is what we're gonna go with. Obtain an additional starter relic. Could be good though. Um. I think the problem is going to be though, a lot of the starter relics are dependent on the class. So I don't think a lot of them would be good. I'm trying to think Ironclads would be okay. Defects is not great. Uh, Silence is all right. Watcher's fine. Bug Knight doesn't do anything. Um, neither does the Potion Brewer really. I guess we get to brew one potion at a combat if we wait three turns. Nothing impactful though. I think we'll do the choose a card. I think these are going to be more fun. This turn, the next gun is fired twice. Dull vision. Bloom gun. Damage and uh, three times. When draw, apply flight. You know, can come at this card will exhaust automatically. Capacity three. So interesting. Apply flight. Flight creatures take 50% less damage. So we'd have to build defensively, but that's 15 for one. I like it. Uh, so it will automatically reload, but will not attack. So, okay. If you use an anonymous, uh, get controlled. Capacity one. Two other enemies based on damage dealt to it. We'll deal damage to other enemies based on damage dealt to it. Loses HP after control. Um, these both sound fun. Well, deal damage to other, it's based on the damage. Dealt to it. So, but it doesn't work on bosses. Let's do balloon gun. Third party controller, I think, would be more one I'd like to pick up and just play with, but I don't know how impactful it'll be. And I can't predict it. Like, I'm not sure how it's working right now. Oh, here's the problem. Okay, so we want to defend. We want to make sure not to take damage. So we're gonna break these two. All right, so we have an exhausted. We're gonna a gun card from here, okay. So we want to rusty sidearm, rusty sidearm, rusty sidearm. And it keeps going back to our hand. I'm trying to remember how the mechanics work because I remember they were a little different. And this is just win. Nice elixir. Press fire, turn a gun, semi automatic. Uh, after playing, it'll come back to you. That's really good. But you have to play the skill first. Does it go to zero? Turn all the guns into semi automatic. We need so much energy, though. But I think it's good enough. Because we could double play the bloom gun for 30 damage based on the offer. Um, let's offer something pretty good. Or we could just offer something normal. <laughs> I thought we'd have more to offer. We'll do a strike. We need our defense. And eh, it's disappointing, I know. I didn't have anything else to offer, though. I'm sorry. Okay, so we have nothing here, so we just really want to put in the strikes. Too bad we lost the suppressive fire. Now, we do want to play the bloom gun. Okay. We have flight, so receive 50% less damage. One to defend for one. Okay, let me see. Select a gun from your discard pile. Reload and return it to your hand. Okay. Crossbow. Manually reload. We don't want to put the bloom gun back. We'll put the crossbow back so we don't draw it again. And it's reloaded. Because the blue gun had more than one shot in it. Make sure. Um, yeah, capacity two. Okay. So this one, reload the gun from your hand. Okay. So, boom. 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 Okay. I don't think I could have killed him. And then, boom. Nice. I gotta remember we need a block first, so we gotta put a random gun from your discard pile in your hand. Put two random guns from your draw pile into your hand. 
Uh, one of these cards. We're going to play the top card. We draw a pile. And it costs one more. When another card enters the card, it costs one less. Is reloaded. Play the top card of your draw pile. And it, and this costs one more. I don't... I need to see what this is. I don't... I forget. It's hard to like... There's so much text on these cards. It's hard to decide how they work. Um, good face, bad face? Bad face. Oh. Weak on the first turn of combat. It's fine, though. Okay. Five damage. Uh, reload a gun from your hand. Oh, I can't. Defend. Uh, let me see. This turn, it gives it a semi automatic. Okay. So, will this crossbow you, I guess? And draw one? Oh, he drew the balloon gun. That's sad. I gotta remember what the crossbow draws. So, reload the Zorg gun. Play the top card. It costs two now. This card enters the pile. It costs one less. So if we play it to two, it goes back to one. So if you like, yeah, okay, I'm getting it. So to play it, we'll play it out, and then we'll have to wait. Okay, I'm understanding how that works now. So pretty much you could use manual reload to um, capacity of zero. So we need to reload it, actually. Um, you can use manual reload to play a free card from the top of your deck. Um, strikes are more, no, these are more damage are the same amount of damage. We're not going to be able to kill it, actually. Nope, because we need to reload it. That's fine, though. Like, we'll, we'll take a little damage. We'll just exhaust the bloom gun. That's all that will happen. Slime, bloom gun, exhaust. Okay. I'm trying to, like, figure out, because some of these do, un like, weird things. From your hand, and clear the capacity. Uh, Ejector. I don't know why. I guess you could... Clear the capacity, reload it, and like keep doing that. Choose any number of guns. I think it could be interesting if we could get a bunch of Zor guns. I I'm still like trying to figure it out. Ten, put the top two cards in your pile. Yeah, I like them because we can put higher cost cards in our deck without like worrying too much about it. Okay, hunger bullet. Every fourth gun you fire, gain block equal to the damage dealt. That's good. Gun shield. I almost just want to take this first. An eight, an eight deal 12 damage. Double its damage. Whew, some of these are good. This is cheaper. So we can take this. What is this? Add a curse? Yeah. Boom. Take that. What what curse was it? Because I might take Toxic Egg, actually. Regret. Ooh, regret kind of sucks, though. Uh, I'll wear all copies of a card, and all copies you obtain. I forget. I, I just want to play this character more. I think Toxic Eggs is going to be good. It's so early in the game. And then we can go up here and get this lead on the way back up. I'm liking it. Remove a card, transform a card, upgrade. Remove a card, get out of here for cred. I do love like when you get a removal like, right afterwards. Ornamental Fan, not bad. Gain some block every time we play three attacks. Smith another card. Let's smith up Bloom Gun. Because it's 21 damage. It's a lot of damage. Yes, there's a chance it'll be exhausted. But I'm fine with that. Bag of prep. Two cards. Additional cards at the start of combat. Okay. So we want to take the flight first thing. Uh, select a gun from your discard. Okay. Here's how we do this. Kill you. We Zor gun you. Manual reload. The Zor gun. Brings it back. Plays the two defend. Now we're defended. Now we can start hitting this Gremlin Wizard. And I guess I could have objected to like empty the clip, but I don't, again, I'm still thinking about how that works. I need more rolls, I think, to really make it worth it. Reload a gun in our hand. Um, nothing's really out though. Rusty sidearm, can I kill you? Yeah, with six, draw a card. Suppress a fire, does it help right now? So I'm just going to play that and end. We got something going. It's just, we still need more pieces. 25 damage. Okay. Draw. Oh, I need to reload you. That stinks. Okay. Get weak. I still will take damage. Play this. Uh, non-attack damage. You deal is increased by two. No. 
affected by block modifiers. Not really crazy. Mayhem. Okay. Reload that. Hit you. If you didn't have the shield, I might have been able to get through that. Ow. Bye bye, balloon gun. Zorgon. Kill them. Uh, manual reload? Yeah. This is how this is played. Oh, and it's played that twice. Interesting. That's kind of a cool little, like, thing. Now here, let's see, are you empty? Capacity three. Zorgon, ejector. So it's zero. Roll on the Zorgon, manually reload it. And it plays it. Okay, that works the way I thought it would. Man, it's a hard combo though. Upgrade all gun carts with the rest of combat. Yeah. Is reloaded. It applies five weak to all enemies. Capacity six. Kind of good. Kind of works with what we're doing too. Five weak whenever it's reloaded. Probably we need more stuff to reload. But gun friendship. Upgrade all guns for the rest of combat. How many guns do we have? It'd be one, two, two currently. For the rest of combat exhaust. I, it's too good, I think. Like, we're, we're going to add more guns to the deck, probably. Almost undoubtedly. Oh, this is a good turn. So, we have manual reload. So, Zorgon. Manual reload. Play friendship. Play that. I could play this again? I think so. No reason to suppress a fire yet. Yeah, play Zorgon again. It's back in there. I don't really need to empty anything. Now, this is be the hard part. It's not taking damage, which I don't think we'll be able to. Actually, well, yeah, we'll take that. Hungry. Roll. Oh, it's in our hand, though. Seven, though. Uh, we're going to take damage immediately, though. Oh, well. It blocked for one turn. Yep. Bloom gun's gone. Okay. Uh, crossbow. Ooh, Zorgon. Yep. Boom. Manual reload. Zorgon. Plays it again. And then reload a gun in your hand. Zorgon. Oh, I didn't play it again, though. The card is reloaded. Yeah. It's only once per turn. That I don't know. If it was, I missed it. <laughs> uh, not as great of a turn. I'll play those two and continue along. Suppress the fire hasn't been as useful as I thought it would be. Uh, there's nothing in there, so that kind of stinks. Ooh, bad turn. Uh, I think I really need the damage. Which kind of stinks. Alright, Zorgon, get that in there. Defend, defend, maybe. Oh man, we need 23 damage really quickly. Ejector. Roll. Zorgon, reload. Play two. Then I think it's crossbow. Reload. Play that. Okay. Eight. We got this. We are doing a lot of less damage, though. Um, reload. Zorgun. It still didn't play it, though. Actually, a little weird. Okay. Orange. 12 max HP. Super good. I really want the Abyssal Tentacle. Lose all block. Yeah. This card kills the enemy. Gain one mark up to three. Uh, charge. Lose all mark. Double this for each mark lost. So. Okay. So I'm going to choose. We charge an additional. Eh, I think I'd rather take the tentacle. Like, it sounds interesting, but also, it sounds like it has a chance to not work. As I drop my phone on the floor. Okay. Boom. The star combo. Crossbow gun friendship. Nice. What we're going to do is we're going to just empty this, just to have it empty. Play this. Roll. Now technically this should, it's empty, it should play the two more cards. And it did this time. I don't feel like it did that last time. Now it costs three. And I bet when it comes back it's going to cost two, because it only goes down by one every time you do it. I think, yeah, five damage. And constrict. Boom, boom. We're going to lose the bloom gun. But again, it's like the first pass that it's really good. Honestly, making it a Nate would be great. Okay, you're gone. Dusted. And I think Constrict will get you. Because it's at the start of my turn. Yeah. Big damage. Fight Saber. Six damage. Remember this card is reloading. Gain 15 block. 
also really good with it, this deck. Curse, though. That's fine. We need a rest, I think. If not, I don't think we'll make it out this fight with a Hexagast. Which, I guess it, the first attack would have been less on that knowledge, but again. Okay, play that. Manual reload. Play it again. I guess I could have made it a suppressive fire, but... Suppressive fire, honestly, might be one of those things we end up taking out of the deck. Boom. Flight. Uh, I don't have a gun in my hand to reload. I don't think we'll also get enough uh, block here. Uh, 12. Yep, we got just enough. Okay. Zorgun, put that in there. Crossbow, draw a card. Six damage coming in. Oh, we have ten, so we might as well play the fight saber. Ten damage. Nice, nice. Not too bad. Okay. You still have... I think I can just continue to stack uh, Constrict. Like, it's really good. We're up to 24. I can't reload you. We're going to crossbow to reload in. I should have played two defends and I'd been fine. Instead of getting like crazy carried away with the constriction and playing the crossbow. Whoops. Manual reload that Zorgun though. Or we can. Six damage. I'd rather have the Zorgun play the top two. Okay. I could play that out or I could. Six damage coming in. We've already lost our better gun and we're getting a little bit extra here. Our uh, balloon gun. So I'm not too upset. Okay. So far, I think I'm least impressed with Suppressive Fire. There has to be a gun it's really good with, and I just don't know what it is. Uh, play Fight Saber. Manual reload it. So we gain a bunch of block. Play it again. Rusty Sidearm. 32 block, yeah. And died from trick. Okay, we have a deck going. I, there's some, definitely some differences I want to make as we go. I think there's things we've done that aren't great, but I think going forward we'll be fine. Gunslinger's form reload all. All reloaded trigger effects are not able to trigger while the gun is fired. When the gun is fired. Ethereal. Okay. So when it's fired, you get the triggered effect. Instead of when it's reloaded. Yeah. I mean, that's, that's what we want. We have tr a bunch of good triggered effects. And another good, not another, uh, add a void to your discard, uh, deal 10 damage to all enemies, loses 99 strength this turn, empty all capacity of the discarded, empty all the gun's capacity in the discard pile. I think this turn your next gun is fired twice, would be better. Okay, we need more energy though. Choose energy and non-energy to attain. Could be good. Uh, Sigma. Uh, and a virus. So. Taking a random ball. I think the virus one's gonna be okay. Because we're gonna make our deck thicker. So, yeah, let's take the virus. We need the energy. Like, it's gonna get bad if we don't have it. Alright, city. We're just gonna continue through here. I don't really want the black card. I want the mystery path. Uh, here, here. Here, here, doom. Yeah, two elites, bunch of good question mark rooms. Um, I think we'll be good. No shop, which is kind of disappointing, but we'll have to make sure to hit one next uh, next floor. Boom, gun friendship. Okay, we could do uh, hungry, hungry. Uh, I want to do this. Manually reload it. Oh, I, I could have made it semi-automatic and got that third shot out. That's where Suppressive Fire would have been good. <laughs> and I could have played it all three times. All right. Fight Saber, Tentacle. So what if I do Double Vision, Zorgun? So both capacity does go down, which is an interesting note. Um, I don't know which one I want to do. I really want the block from Fight Saber. I'm not going to be able to get it. So I think I will go ahead and knock you down so you'll die next turn. I thought it was just the next gun. Is it the next two guns? Okay. I'm, I missed that somehow. And I had another energy I could play another card. We even didn't take damage. Somehow I missed that also. Virus. Put a copy in your hand. Gross. 
So we're gonna fill up our deck with viruses. That's fascinating. But hopefully we'll go add more cards and just keep bloating the deck for that. Okay, so play this. Now this one should just happen, right? Yep. And that also keeps viruses from getting in our hand, which I kind of like. We just need a way to make a power innate. That'd be very good. Okay, so if I roll fight saber, play fight saber, manually reload Zorgun, gun, play the top two, tentacle, um, nine, nine, and they're both knocked down. Yeah, we got a good combination going. I haven't seen all the guns, so it's always interesting to see what some of these guns do. And there's some cool synergies. Uh, draw a card, put a gun from your draw pile into your hand. Draw one card. Okay. So that could be nice. 10, slight, and reload a gun card from your hand. Does six additional damage. That's good. Yeah. Block for 10, and then just has some bonus effects. Five cards, more gold. Give me it all. I'm going for it this time. Uh, I think I want both relics. Hallucination, depression, yeah. Take them both. Took a doubt. Start your combat. All enemies lose 50% max HP. Lose 10% recurrent HP. At the end of each round, if you are above, say, lose 5 HP. Current max HP. I think that's fine. It seems like we're going to get hurt unless we have low HP, but... That's fine. Gain two strength and one and lose one dex. More damage. I mean, it kind of fits with some of the stuff we have. So we're kind of like going to be a glass cannon now. So, okay, we have a, a mean one. Okay, this going to be a bad turn. Ugh. Okay, gunslingers form. Definitely. I want to play Zorgun to hope for some block maybe. And we didn't get it. That was a lot of our good cards are there. Ugh. A lot of damage, and they take damage. Okay. Manual reload. Zorgun. Play two. Uh, manual reload. Zorgun again. Okay. Crap. I'm going to need to deal some damage, like, quick. They're going to hit me. Actually, I'm going to do this. Yeah, you're done. Yep. <laughs> oh, you're not done. Two more, I can play one gun. I can kill either one of these, pretty much. But I'll get a defend in if I do it this way. Or I can do, yeah, 13. I can't play that one. Okay. Fine, we'll take, oh, no damage. I actually should play the sidearm again. Um, roll. This is another bad turn. Four more damage, if I can only do it. Cause now we're gonna take 10 more. Yeah, I forgot we're at seven curse. We're gonna start seeing very bad guys. More gold, got money stolen back. Another macho break? Another macho break could be good. Practice makes perfect. Cost one less for each gun reload of this combat. Draw five cards, eh. Another macho brace. We, we're, we seem a little under defensive, so. Panacea, two artifacting. Okay, apparently we want that. The ultimate card, I don't really want that, it's a curse. Eh. Ooh, Dark Matter. Ooh, Manual Reload would be great. I get one more. I guess... Uh, on full capacity to switch the mode for capacity. Well, I might, might as well try it. See how many gold cards we can stack, apparently. 36. Eh, we'll see how we do. I really want to upgrade. I guess Tentacle is really good for longer, like, for the boss combats. All right, plus 50%. Oh my. This is going to be not very fun. Bad hand to start off with too, like nothing. Um I think I'm going to do the thorns. I guess I will just play out some stuff. Doesn't really matter too much. Okay, it's called bigger. Oh, that's the same one that that uh relic the the red looking relic gives you. Okay. Take a look, get flight. So it just, you just fly whenever you start with that. Um, that, yeah, this is a bad ordering on these cards. So we're gonna take 10, so we're immediately gonna lose our balloon gun, which kind of sucks. And just the increase in damage, this is not fun. 
Okay, more damage, and now we're going to take another 21. Because our draw has been very bad. Okay. Watch our brace. Double vision, crossbow. The ultimate card is poop. Uh, might as well play it though. Uh, it just does nothing. Didn't matter though, because we didn't have it no more. We could play the Marcho Brace again, but it's fine. Artifacting, I think, is really helping here. Manual reload. Zorgun, I think. Played Hungry Bullets. And that might be it. Like, one combat. Done us in. Okay. And that was so fun. We had such a good thing going, but it was like two or three bad draws in a row. Alright, we're going to do another one. Boop. Gun. Hunter. I wonder if the rest of the characters would ever be added to this mod. Uh, talk. Let's see. Taint an additional starter relic. Counter a random event. Ta choose a card to obtain. Ma eh. Let's do the additional one. Boom. Dark Rift. Infinite Spire. Add a random black card to your deck. Okay. Sounds interesting. I've never heard of that one, but I'll take it. All right, what kind of elites do we got? I don't see a good starting question mark path. I think here, here, up through here, um, here, through here, and then we can duck, duck out if we need to. Later shop. I think we'll take this elite in there. Okay. It didn't start out great, but it had a decent execution. Pretty good. We'll do this, this, and then one defend. Guess we should watch our HP more this time. Ooh, execution. Get that shred. Extra damage. Cool. Take seven here. Because, yeah, shred makes them take more damage. Blocked it. Not anymore. Not anymore. Can I manually, manually reload? Nothing. Oh, and it adds more shred, so it takes 60% more damage. Does it stack? The rest of combat. Yeah. Very good. Uh, let's roll. The crossbow, play the crossbow. Dealing 18, I really don't want to take that, so we'll defend. So yeah, that'd be good in a very, like a zero cost build. Manual reload, uh, strike, dead. I could have paid attention to seeing I could have killed him. Uh, conditional reflex, draw one when you reload. Just gonna return it to your hand. Not bad. Uh, if I take him, put the card in here. I don't really like any of these. I'll do this one just because it's a draw. I think it upgrades to be okay. To draw one from the discard or from the top of the deck. Infinite blow. Not too great. I will do one defend and one strike. Take one damage. Okay, yeah. 12 damage for two. It's only good if you uh, have like played stuff with it before. It's manual reload or like upgraded a bunch of times in previous games. Um, not really, like, I don't want to take any more damage, so I guess I'll do that. Guess I should have played the pistol technically and then reloaded it, but it's fine. Switch. I confirm. It's fine. Reload that. I guess infinite blow. Ooh, the animation looked cool. I guess that's a benefit. Hungry bullets again. I liked it. Air force gonna fire, gain damage, or gain block equal to its damage. Seems useful, especially later on. It's a good building block card. <laughs> Cost 134 gold on mushroom. For a fellow lower charge. Whenever you rest, heal any relics you have and gain two max HP. Is it whenever you rest though? Yeah. Odd mushrooms, okay. Let's just do a, I mean, however. Do we have a late shop? Yeah, we do. Let's save for the shop and just take this. A little max HP, and if we have to rest, at least we'll get a little bit of uh, advantage. We'll wait this time, follow the moth, and get the dream nail. Because there's literally no reason not to. Mostly. Okay, play this. Boom. Shoot ya. Manual reload a gun. Uh, we go. Let's play one defend. Take the one damage, it's fine. Draw your entire draw pile. You cannot draw any more cards this turn. Sure. 
Fill up the hand. Now I have, I guess, a good choice of what to play. Which I'm just going to play the rusty sidearm three times. Alternating between enemies. Okay. I kind of just want to play rusty sidearm bunch. Um, we'll reload this and then we'll play some. Could manually reload it. I think the crossbow would have been what it would have been. What it would have been. Um, I have no... I guess I can have defense. Um, do this. Kill that one. And strike this one. Haven't hit it as much, but... I think this combat gets much simpler once you get down to one enemy. Semi-automatic. Just keep playing the rusty sidearm. No reason not to. And right, now they have thorns. So one defend. Get the crossbow done. Do that. So this turn we should get a bunch of... Health, we had something to play. So just double defend. All right, I guess the roll would have been better, but, oh, we still took some damage. Hey, this is what happens when you don't pay attention. So one defend, I guess he had more momentary thorns. So it uh, was only, uh, only active over so many turns. Couldn't think for a second. Anyway, he doesn't intend to attack. Gain E. Oh, gain energy. Draw one card, apply one vulnerability, or gain 10 block. Interesting. So you get like a bunch of different options. Uh, da, 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 up to one gun from your hand. Two guns. I think I'll take Probe Strike. This seems good. Yeah, if it doesn't seem to attack, draw a card, apply one vulnerability, or gain 10 block. So it's like very like selective in what you do. Sticky crossbow, apply 12, explosive arrow, semi-automatic. Is reloaded, deal the corresponding level of damage. So it could deal a lot. I think I'll try it. We need, we kind of need a source of damage going into this elite fight. So you kind of just really want to apply a bunch of sticky crossbow. So, okay. So if he is attacking, you gain the, the 10 block. I could have played another strike. Hopefully it doesn't matter too much. Um, does this draw it? No, it puts in discard. Okay. Nice to know. And then block for five. I'm going to watch actually how many things happen. What if I do, let's go ahead and drink this attack potion. I think it could help Mega Hand. Uh, combine rifle to switch the mode. Sure. Uh, three, three times. Deal 25, might as well. Because that's like super good because it's going to kill this one this turn. Boom. Oh, it must be at the end of the turn. Interesting. Boop. Um, confirm, leave that one up there. Or did it drop it? No. Okay. Um, I think I just want to double defend and then get the 10 block here. Yeah. 25 to all of them. Nice. Worked the way I kind of expected it. Which is always good. Oh, I need to... I wish... Oh, reel it in the hand. Draw it. Sticky crossbow. Nice. So, the, I think sticky crossbow, I guess, would work good with the semi-automatic thing. Because you kind of want to play it a bunch of times. Um, so, I guess that's how that would be, like, one of the, the good uses for it. Combined rifle. And then... Switch fast. Uh, throw that to the, into the graveyard. Doesn't intend to attack, so gain energy and draw a card. Okay, I'm figuring out that too. So this should be almost game. Yeah, 25 here and one. Oh, he went into leaf barrier. Okay, so I kind of want to do that, that, that. 48. So if I, oh, I can't manually reload it because it doesn't go. So that's what um, I guess it's obje object ob objector would do. Or ejector. I can't talk apparently. So 25 more this turn. Gain 10, deal 25 to him. Reload and does 47. Okay. So you have to have a good way to empty it. Rummage, four cards, discard guns. Discard cards that are not guns. Okay. I think I want to take Dark Matter because we didn't get to see what it did last time. Like we got to use it once, but that was it. Okay, we can smith. I'm going to do Hungry Hippo. 
little bit more block randomly. I think that card would be better if you could get a couple copies of it. Okay. At least four. Uh, fight your, uh, actually, remove two cards from your deck, I think it's better. Because there's only a 5% chance, so let's remove the two cards. Yeah, this the two strengths. I don't know what that was. Um... I think we did the 5 HP last time. Tiff a poll. Never longer be surprised by mimics. Which I feel like happens a pretty good bit. Like here. Not surprised. Negated. Um, he's not attacking. So we might as well gain the energy and draw the card. Switch. Reload. Switch it. So play it for 15. Reload. It switches it. Uh, hmm. Specific card. Win. Huh. I don't feel like he switched. Felt like it did the same thing both times. Which is fine. We'll figure it out. Okay. Can't find to confuse all of these. Draw each turn. Has its stats scrambled. Sure. He negated it, but I'll take it. So we're going to kill you this way, it looks like. Um, I should have played Hungry Bullets first. Because we would have got two more charges on it. It's fine. We also have a bunch of shielding, so. Roll? Question mark? Sure. All right, uh, throw the defend out. Sticky crossbow, sticky crossbow. Reload it, deal 48 damage. I'm liking that. Malbank, not bad. We're, even though we're going to a shop soon, so. Man, 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 man. I still think this could be good. Four times once the card gets reloaded, gain seven blocks. I like this, though, because it's just so much damage. Uh, strength is going to be ridiculous with it. I think I'm just going to leave, because, again, shop. All right. Um, gain 10 block, 3 damage 4 times. Not as much, not as good. 18. Now there we go. Because I think this is our scaling factor currently. I would take a second one if I could. Curse bullets gain strength equal to half your curse points. We're at 1. This probably gives us 1, so we'd probably be at 1 strength. Uh, Alright, clear goo on stone. I like. Um, what is this? Dragon fruit. Whenever you draw a stats card, does six damage to all enemies. Interesting enough. Uh, before you take damage, double your unblock damage. I think this is okay, but not necessary. It fits the Gungeon aesthetic very well, though. Take this one for 57. Oh, the Nod Key. I should have known it was right there. Dummy. Um, I don't think we'll be strong enough to fight the rat. But if we were going to plan to... Let's take the max HP. Sure. Get that meat button. Even though we're going straight into an elite fight. Alright, hunger bullets. Um, defend. I need to defend for 8 to keep the meat button. Definitely can't. Wait. Uh, draw one card. We draw a parasite. I confirm that's fine. Alright, see how fast you can lose meat button? So. Oh, actually, we're fine. I forgot we got all these like extra little blocks. Ooh, death touch, but the problem is we can't. Is this one semi-automatic? No. So we really need to do that. Manual reload it. Unfortunately, uh, we can't play death touch. And then we'll cross though. So we get a ton of block. But that would be really good. We could, act could have actually killed it here. Um, yeah, sticky crossbow, sticky crossbow, sticky crossbow. Prepared for reloading it, so we can do 18 damage. Doing the call. All right. Oh, 12. 12. Yeah, dead. We are getting stronger. I can't say that the guns and people are actually much stronger. Um, so we might have a chance against the rat. Drop an additional rare card reward. Elites drop an additional rare card reward. Pretty good. To all enemies' capacity. One, stun all enemies if capacity has been lowered to zero. Exhaust. So there's capacity one. It's capacity of big. I'll try it. Just the fact that it does damage to all enemies is why I'm kind of taking it back. Nine damage. All enemies. We have no AoE, so it's pretty good. And we'll see how the stun works right now. Does this just stun him? No. Okay. Um, I can't reload, so we will confirm to keep that. I think, yeah, we're just going to keep stacking that. And we're just going to take 15 and lose the meat button. 
because there was no way to keep it. Me button is gone. I can't remember if it does it uh, every combat though. At the beginning of the combat, you place you place stuns. It hits for one turn. The next big stuns enemy. Okay, the next attack you play stuns an enemy for one turn. Got it. <laughs> I read that way too many times. So he stuns. Okay. Manual reload. Sticky crossbow brings it back. So, and it does the 36. Hungry bullets. Uh, probe strike, give me that. Play that. Pew pew. Okay. Camera. Flash. Huntsman. Punch damage. Okay. We're surviving here. I think we'll get through this fight pretty handily. Crossbow, crossbow, crossbow. So, that I think is one of the disadvantages of the sticky crossbow, is that it only deals four damage. So it's not very good with hungry bullets. So we have two more, manual reload. Oh, we had nothing in the brawl pile, so. Should've played that first, uh, but we'll take the block. So the next card we get should get um, equal to unblock. So we want to do something with high damage first. Highest most camera. So yep, nine block. Boom. Yeah, boom. Seven health left. And I have like no explosive potion or nothing. We block 11. Pretty good. Huntsman, fuck kill. Okay, figuring it out. Okay. I haven't seen, oh, we've seen fight saber. Whenever you have a reload, draw one card. So bad. Your next gun will be fired repeatedly until the capacity is zero. Yes. Could be really good. Uh, I believe I've heard it. We'll start with a random buff. Gain 100 gold on pickup. I kind of like this. I, I don't mind the wanted poster. It's pretty much like 100 gold, give the enemy a buff. Which is fine. Assuming the buff's not too strong, which I don't really remember. Um, it's fine. Let's see, elites. Uh... It's not, there is a two elite, but it's way up there. Can I do it without just going straight? Yeah, it's kind of like go down that path. I'd rather go up this path to here, here, here. Up through here, yeah. We do miss an elite, but I don't know if we're on Ascension 1 or Ascension 0, but it's fine. Okay, Hungry Bullets, Huntsman. Ow. Oh, you have the random buff. Which is... Oh, no, you have a bunch of random buffs because we're b below. So you have... Game 1 Strength and we play Power. Thorns. Uh, aggressive. And you have Might. All attacks with done For the next two turns. Interesting. Get a bunch of defense. Okay. I need to remember that they have buff. I forgot it's not just one buff. It's a buff per 100 we don't have. So, in theory, if I do... Firepower and camera. Yep. Oh man, watch your eyes. And one strike. Oh yeah, he splits into a bunch. So he took a little damage, but that's fine. A sticky crossbow for that's gonna be really good. Split up the damage, then we roll. Oh, I can only do one. Reload this one. Okay. And I can't finish him off, can I? I have one more I can deal. Kill that one. Fast switch. Manual reload is fine. So we take no damage, which is good. And he has one left. All right. Dark matter. All right, freezing potion's not bad. High calorie, six damage. Apply six out of body. Cut. Completely unblock attack, loses corresponding levels of HP. Of body by one. I don't get what that means, but I will we'll try it. Let's keep taking more interesting cards. All right, time collector. Oh, he ends your turn. That's kind of gross. <laughs> don't really like that. I knew they like gain buffs, but that seems like a lot. <laughs> Okay, um, we could camera. We actually could just kill one of you, probably. Who's the most annoying? You are. 
and then oh it doesn't empty oh capacity zero yeah blow that one out so we won't take any damage so that's pretty much like almost like an insta kill on any normal thing do two damage draw one card add a new okay that might as well okay do this keep that high caliber out of body i still don't takes unblocked damage lose five max hp interesting so when I attack him, he'll lose 10 damage and 4 max HP. No. Uh, unblocked attack. Oh yeah, he takes 4 damage. It's not max HP, it's just 4 damage. And yeah. Okay, so it's like, does additional damage. Okay. Got it. Gun used, it gets exhausted. That's fine. Take this one. More damage. Might be able to have the total damage tended towards you. Okay. Uh, no, I think I'm good. Definitely interesting though. All the humming. Where, eh, nah, I'm good. We kind of need the gold. Okay. Okay. One, two, Three. Oh, some of you blocked it. You blocked it specifically. Uh, reload. Just a lot more damage. Okay. And we're not taking any. Oh, they he all heal. That's not fun. Okay. Um, watch your eyes. Camera. Does hurt. Very painful. Pain out of 10. And then we'll play this twice. And he's not dead. Alright, stolen soul. Uh, is this to random enemies? Yeah. Play this. I was hoping that would kill them, but it did not. Alright. It's fine. And they heal so quickly. This is going to be an annoying fight. Uh, if the only gun in your hand, deal damage. Double damage. It can be the only one though, so we'll do that to that. That to you. 36 damage. We can almost kill this one. Oh, it did die. Awesome. Draw me a defend, not very helpful. Gain 10 block. We're actually taking a fair amount of damage in this fight because they're healing so quickly. Oh well, I guess we'll just play all three of these. Sure. I just want to kill this one if I can. Dark Matter, awesome. Throw that in discard. And we wait, they gain 10 more health and add more junk to our deck. Hungry Bullets, yep, Stolen Soul. Roll. And I can't, yeah. I can't draw any more cards. Okay, here we go. Shield your eyes. Unfortunately. Oh, I had to reload that one. Nice. Oh, man. Let's just do Rusty Sidearm because I know it'll kill him. Don't have to worry about some weird... I guess the high caliber I could have done it in one because it would have done, like, the damage after the fact. Sticky crossbow. Once I reload you, this thing is dead. Whatever HP it's at, it's not gonna matter. Doo doo. Probe strike. Oh, this is also does a lot of damage to it. Oh, it has to be reloaded too. Throw that in discard pile. Execution on that. Okay. Uh, I'm not even playing the camera. I hurt everyone's eyes. I don't want that. All right, dark matter, and then play that out. We're getting there. It's just a really long fight. We really so m we just picked up four st uh, stolen souls and discard all of them. Okay, 72 damage. Longer fight than it needed to be. Um, I think Potion of Gun Friendship is going to be good. It's just if we want to upgrade it. Okay, um, Angry Bullets. One, two. Um, we'll gain block, so watch your eyes. It's even hurting my eyes at this point. I didn't know I'd be so aggressive about it. Uh, I don't really want to play Hall. 
Actually, I'll play Hall. Fast switch, that's fine. Hall, get everything in here. In your hand for the rest of combat. Okay, nice. Huntsman. Manual reload. Um, sticky crossbow. Play it for two more. That's kind of like our win con right now. Sticky crossbow for game. Or you could overpower like the dark matter. So, I still don't think I've seen it transform. Two damage, two times six. It kills an enemy upon reload. It deals damage according to the maximum HP of all slain enemies to all. Okay. So pretty much you take a bunch of inner, like uh, life from an energy enemy and then deal it all back. If I could talk. Um, we're going this way, right? Yeah. I thought there was a shop we were going to. I think I missed path somewhere. No, this looks right. I thought... I guess I looked and I thought there was a shop and there was definitely not, so. Oh well, we still need the money. He has time collector, that's fine. We don't have really have any guns in our hand. Um we can No. No, this is not a really a good I guess we will overpower. But we can't play the pistol. My bad. I guess I could play it twice. Oh, it's the next gun too. So actually, that didn't matter. I guess I'm glad I played the uh, the high caliber. Something. Draw everything. So orbital life is twelve. And it, but that also hits every time on that. Oh my goodness. Okay. I I got what we're doing now. Double vision. Uh, Eureka! Draw cards until you have three guns. I think I'd rather have double vision. Upgrade card of the first turn. It really wants us to get the Elm Thaler. Eight damage, apply four congealed. You, you play twice, promote one level in this game. When you lose HP, you still buy one. Uh, I think I'm okay. We'll take the cheese gun. Okay. Overpowered, we'll lose exhaust. I think this is necessary for the way we're doing this. It's kind of like play a card until it kills someone. Okay, um, we kind of want to. One, two, we played the wrong card. One, roll, reload the crossbow, deal some damage. We get a double, what, 18 more if we would have done it right? Yeah, it's fine now. Uh, uh, oh, we get to look through the whole deck. What card would we not want is the, to draw is the thing. Don't draw the uh, crossbow. Manual reload. I don't. Select a gun from your discard pile. And, and draw pile. I was like, what? Why are we looking at these? Um. I don't really know what to reload. Sure. Oh, just bring, pretty much just like pick a gun and put it in your hand almost at this point. I should pick the crossbow again. Would have been the correct choice. Okay. Block, block, block. Play this for no reason. I'm just doing tight damage. Had a wound. Final strike. Okay. Um. Final strike. Well, I can't kill either one of you. You. Dark matter, you. Camera, both of them. Oh, they both turned into nonsense monsters. I thought there was just a chance that they did that. Yeah, okay. But this is gonna be how we do this. Life orb. So once we, re yeah, once we reload it, it's gonna do a bunch of damage uh, to all of them. And I think it'll kill them. Okay, we are about to take a slew of damage here. Oh, it actually kills us. Oh. I don't think we could have prevented that though. But we almost can go in for an hour. These ones take a while, but they're always so interesting. I'm excited to play um, her again. Uh, but that's going to be it. I hope you guys did enjoy. If you did, you can hit the like button or subscribe if you want to see more. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye, guys.